Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Firstly, ignore this light. I could not get good lighting in this bathroom, so we just have to deal with the light here. So just pretend he's not there, he doesn't bite, it's fine. Today I'm doing another video with INH hair, which I am freaking obsessed with. I love their hair. If you guys didn't see, I did try out their ponytail, which was featured in Ariana Grande's music video. Not to brag, but that's pretty iconic. <laughs> so when they hit me up again, I was so excited. As you can see, I'm a new woman today because I have long hair. If you guys are interested, they did give us a code. It is Sophia Camarda for 10% off site-wide. Also, if you guys need help getting color matched, you can DM them on Instagram and they will help you pick the perfect hair color. But yeah, their products are really high quality. I'm so impressed, especially with this right here. It is so iconic. I'm gonna show you guys how I applied these extensions and of course, how I got this cute space bun hairstyle at the end. So you do see just the hair down and then you see the space buns because why not they're adorable so let's just get started okay guys so this is my natural hair and as you can see it is quite short it is the product of being bored at home I cut my hair very short a few months ago and this has been the look which I love my short hair but I have always been curious what it's like to use extensions especially in hair this short and I do recommend kind of like straightening your hair first because these extensions have a very like silky texture the first thing you want to do is just brush out your normal hair and make sure there's no knots in it then what you want to do is go in with your extensions they give you this bag and it comes with a bunch of extensions and I use them all because I'm extra so this set actually comes with a bunch of different sizes so first of all it comes with a one clip like this and it comes with three of these plus the tester strand so when you get them there's like one of these that you can test out and see if the color is good and then there's three other ones so in total there's four there are two of the three clip like this there are two of the two clip like this there are two of the four clip which is huge like this what you do first is put your hair all up except for the very like back of your neck kind of like this just a little bit of hair. The rest of it, I like to just tie up and I use a scrunchie so my hair doesn't get like dented or anything. And I also kind of like clip it up just so there's no hair in the way. So get your first strand and what you can do is spray a little hairspray if you want it to really stick well. I don't really do that just because I think it's fine. These clips are very sturdy. So I brush it out. So then you unclip each clip. By the way, this is my first time like having extensions. I've literally worn these one other time just testing them out and it's crazy like you can learn it so quick so so you want to take it as close to the root as possible and clip down the middle clip then you want to clip down the other clips and as you can see we have some long hair <laughs> imagine just having this oh my god so then you want to let down a little more hair what you want to do is section it again I like to do just another little thin section kind of like above the ears like this and you want to try to keep it as straight as possible I don't do this fancy like I literally just take my hair and throw it in a ball <laughs> Just so it's out of the way So then I'm gonna take another three clip and I'm going to brush it out and then same thing You want to unclip it and just stick it at the root and when you clip it Make sure it's not like pulling out your hair or anything Make sure it's very comfortable because you're gonna be wearing this the whole day So you don't want it to be like tugging your hair so go to the root clip go to the root and clip okay now I'm letting down more hair now I'm gonna go a little above my ears and we are going to clip kind of closer to the front of our face because we're gonna be using a four clip so I'm gonna take the four clip and I'm gonna brush it out very nice unclip the clips and we are going to place this at the root this one doesn't have a middle clip you kind of have to like find the middle with your fingers so clipping in and then clipping in side and then the other side you can kind of like look in the mirror to make sure you're clipping it well like that very nice <laughs> and then we're gonna do another four clip so I'm gonna go a little higher maybe like at the temple gonna brush the four clip out again undo the clips <laughs> I'm sure you guys are catching on by now again I'm just gonna take it find the middle and then we're just gonna clip at the root and at the sides this side like so so as you can see it's like starting to go towards more the front of our face 
and really like filling out. Let down the hair, then I'm gonna do about this much. So this is kind of like my front hairs and like more shorter pieces at this point. I'm going to kind of like clip this just so it's not everywhere. So now we're gonna go in with the two clip pieces on the sides, obviously brush it out, <laughs> unclip. And I'm gonna go one on this side, one on this side, obviously. So I'm just gonna go about like here and just clip down like that. And obviously it looks kind of funny, but when you put your hair down, it's a lot better. So I'm gonna do the same on this side. As you can see, line it up on the roots like so. Just like that. That's actually very comfortable. <laughs> These feel very nice. The longer ones are a little more heavy, so keep that in mind. And already it's looking so pretty, but I'm gonna put down these extra hairs. And as you can see, my hair is like needing to be blended still, but I'm gonna go in and add the one pieces. So I'm just gonna lift up like the very thin hairs at the top and add the one pieces. So I like to do them all. So I'm gonna do two of the one pieces on each side. Make sure it's even too when you do the partings. I'm gonna do like one on the side, maybe like right here. And then maybe one a little more close to the front, like this. So that's very nice. Flip it back over. And as you can see, your hair kind of covers the clips from the extensions. Obviously, that's how it works. <laughs> so now we're gonna do this. Clip it and I'm just gonna clip two pieces right here. So you got the one, do it a little more toward the back, like right here. Boom. <laughs> Last one is gonna go a little more toward the front just to get that nice blend. Flip over this piece. Obviously, if you don't have a middle part, do it as needed. <laughs> Here's the hair so far. And as you can see, for having such short hair, it's actually blending pretty well already. I could leave it like this and it would be fine. Like you would know it's extensions, but it would be fine. <laughs> but what I'm gonna do now is kind of just like brush everything lightly so I don't rip out my hair in case I grab a clip or anything, but just lightly brush it out. And this is really pretty already, but I'm gonna go in and blend everything a little more by curling it. it is very long. I don't know if you can really tell, but it's very long. So I'm gonna curl it and then I'm gonna show you guys one of my favorite hairstyles that I figured out with these extensions. So let's do a little curling tutorial now, like a very quick one. I'm gonna split my hair in half like this. And this hair can be curled. I'm pretty sure you can use up to like 325, so just be very careful, treat it like real hair. But I'm gonna turn on my curling iron, and this is the one I use. I'm gonna set it to 310, <laughs> just to be safe. I also have a glove. Isn't it crazy seeing me with long hair? Like even when I was trying to grow up my hair, it was not this long. My hair is so like baby hair, it could never do this. <laughs> so I'm just like admiring it and petting it, <laughs> like it's Dolce. I'm I'm gonna start curling now, so I'm just going to go in sections and, wait, let me put on the glove. Wait, if I'm holding it. Okay, this one needs the glove. Okay, so I'm just gonna go in and take like a good piece. I'm not doing like big sections, about that much. And I'm just gonna curl it and it makes it look so pretty. It's like mermaid hair. You know, I just realized I put the glove on the wrong hand. I really am a genius. You guys should definitely subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but I'm just gonna hold it. You guys know how to curl your hair. I'm gonna keep doing this and then we will be back. So here is the finished hair, just regular. It looks so good. It's actually crazy like how real it looks. <laughs> it really looks like I'm this like Italian bombshell. Like I have thick hair, like that kind of thing. <laughs> But as you can see, it just looks great. It's so nice and like easy to blend. And considering how short my hair is, like that's the biggest thing. I have short, blunt hair. Like it is hard to blend that. Like I don't have long hair, I don't have layers. It's very like straight line short. So the fact that this actually looks good is crazy. Let me show you the back. So here's the back. I don't know if it's as blended from the back. Overall, it looks great. Now I want to show you guys one of my like go-to hairstyles. I do this with short hair. I do this with now long hair. I think it looks absolutely amazing. So what I'm going to do is create space buns. And I was inspired by Ariana Grande. She did this interview and she had like super long hair and space buns. 
ones. With my hair personally, these extensions are a tad lighter, like not to the point where they don't match, but they are a tad lighter than my normal hair. So when I do the space buns, it really brings out like sort of like a subtle ombre look and it's so pretty and I just love it. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna section my hair. You can do this with your finger or like a comb and just bring out basically anything in front of your ear like this and everything else goes back. This is a very simple hairstyle that I think looks absolutely adorable. I do it too often, like I think I'm overdoing the space ones lately, but I don't care. And I also like it with extensions because it really helps to blend even more. Just because it looks like it's really your hair when you have like a specific hairstyle. You know, it's not just long hair, you kind of have like it all blended. I don't know. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. You want to take a small hair tie like this so that it's very tight because these are kind of heavy so I'm gonna brush up kind of like this like going up from your cheekbones so it's giving you a bit of a lift and you're going to take this and tie it high up like that so I'm gonna take this hair tie the little one and just tie this in place and make a ponytail don't do the space bun yet so it's literally going to look like this. Leave it like this for now. We're gonna do the other side and literally do the same exact thing. Just grab all the hair that's in front of your ear and pull it up. Grab the little hair tie and tie it into place. And then obviously just tighten it and also make sure they're even so they're not like crazy when you do the buns. Now that we look like some kind of bug, <laughs> we're going to actually make the bun. So, so with this you want to use bigger hair ties and I'm just going to literally wrap it around. So take it, maybe take your finger and just like keep it in place and wrap the hair around your finger like this. Now, this is your preference on how neat you want it. I like them kind of messy, so you can like try to keep it very exact or you can just throw the hair tie on and see what sticks. So that's what I'm gonna do is just kind of go at it, pull it through. I like this kind of messy look and I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. <laughs> Hold your finger down and wrap and then get your hair tie and just do the same exact thing. There we go. Now what you may wanna do is just take out some baby hairs. Some people like it really sleek. I don't. I like to have kind of like a full hairstyle going on so I'm just gonna go in and kind of like pull them out. You could even get a comb and just go like this and just get out any of the extra hairs. I have a widow's peak kind of so these kind of hairstyles are a little hard but you can achieve it just put your mind to it. <laughs> you can make it look good. So everything still looks very blended. I'm actually surprised on how blended the hair is like maintaining. This is an optional step. I like to go in around my hairline and add eyeshadow just to kind of get it dark looking. So I use the chocolate bar palette and just go into the dark brown and just kind of like fill it in. When you have a tight hairstyle like this, it will expose your ass. I mean, you don't have to do this, but I like to, just cause it really makes your hair look so voluminous and just like you have a lot of hair, you know what I mean? Maybe you don't have to do this because you actually have hair, but again, I have fine baby hair, so this hairstyle is something that I could never, ever, 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 ever achieve on my own. So I'm very grateful for this sponsorship. <laughs> <laughs> it looks love. Oh, I got it on my head. I'm an idiot. All right, so here is the finished hairstyle. I am so obsessed with how this looks. I literally feel like, I don't know, just some kind of space queen. I don't know. I love this hair. I'm definitely going to be wearing this a lot, so don't be surprised if you see me with long hair in a lot of videos coming up. I've always wanted extensions. This is such a vibe. I don't know what took me so long to try them, but yes, the quality is absolutely amazing. I'm so impressed with just everything. I love the color. I love the texture and I just love how easy it is. Like all you have to do is just clip it in and that's it. Even if you just go like this, like, even this is so cute, like, having all the hair in the back, that's such a vibe. Like, hello, hi. I feel like a baddie. <laughs> yeah, so that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. Let me know if you have any questions. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys.